Hey y'all, Soda City Realtor here. Let's talk about what's shaking on the west side of the city these days. West Columbia is experiencing what some would call a revival, a rebirth of its image and what it wants to offer to its residents. There's a lot going on over here. A recent development plan is helping the city focus on improving several things, aesthetics, quality of life, and private investments, i.e. home values and local businesses. West Columbia has always had a small town feel, but that was okay since we had easy access to Columbia. But now, the city is making it a goal to keep you right here in the heart of WECO. Recently adding the new Brooklyn complex, which includes four buildings that provide high-end apartments, retail space on State Street, and one of my favorite spots, the rooftop bar at the Black Rooster. You gotta check out that view. A new community park? My daughter loves this place. Art displays and a covered area for the artisan market each week. Several restaurants a beer garden, unique local shops, and a brewery are also within walking distance to each other. Using crosswalks and shuttles to help with connectivity, this is most definitely becoming a pedestrian-centered place, wanting residents and visitors to park your car, get out, and enjoy the area on foot. I already know what you're thinking. Where in the world are we gonna park? Well, along with the new parking garage and public parking areas, the city has created over 200 extra parking spots in this district. With the River District drumming up energy and businesses, the Meeting Street Corridor is not far behind. As someone who grew up here in West Cola, it has really been exciting to watch this transformation take place. I can't wait to see what the next few years bring. Listen, I absolutely love this area and I would love the opportunity to tell you about housing here in WECO. Feel free to reach out if you have any questions. Thank you guys, have an awesome day.